Welcome, I'm the Emperor, this is Dungeons 4, and I'm so happy you're here! It's still the Christmas season, and we're gonna continue with the campaign on mission 19, the Rune Sockets of Finitude. But, I'm not gonna play this on an hard... I'm old! You understand? I'm old! Can't do this anymore! And it's actually quite, quite, quite difficult, too difficult for me. So, we're gonna play it on normal and have a good time instead. Uh, so one tip here hands off my stones no stones can be allowed to take any damage in the rune sockets of finitude the flamethrowers from the dwarves go through walls so keep that in mind uh, that's how I didn't get it on the last attempt which I won't be uploading here then uh, use the healing stone easy just turn it on and you pretty pretty much got it build 50 traps sounds doable but yeah we'll see and the rune sockets of finitude now uh, the Rune Sockets of Finitude, let's, let's go. Uh, this is my setup, Talia, 50% extra damage. I don't think we're gonna do that, actually. Instead, uh, we might be going with the Hero's Grave. When one of your creatures dies permanently, you receive a random ghost hero of the same level. P that's pretty neat, I think. And I do want to go for Undead more than anything in this one, so... Let's go, let's get going and listen to all the things they're gonna tell us now. Okay, so now we've wasted time putting the Stones of Finitude into the Rune Sockets of Finitude. So what's next? Move the Rune Sockets somewhere and use them to form the Stone Circle of Finitude? Talia could hardly wait to embark on the ritual and infuse the stones with power. But in fact, just saying the secret magic word, Xylopilo, was enough to start the ritual. Yeah, sure. I say Xylopilo, and then you'll say something stupid, like in that previous mission, the Ascent, with the flavory dicks or whatever it was. And so Talia set the ritual in motion. Hey, wait a minute. What the hell? I'm not even prepared yet. My dungeon from the previous map suddenly disappeared. I'm starting from scratch here. Talia was not yet fully aware of the consequences of the ritual. She probably thought she would be charging the Gauntlet of Finitude, but in fact, the genius evil was following a different plan. I beg your pardon? Why am I only being told this now? And this genius evil you're talking about, that little rug rat over there, fervently stuffing a booger in his mouth. If you wouldn't keep interrupting me, these long intro sequences would be much shorter. Look, it's quite simple. Take good care of the stones so they don't get broken. Unfortunately, someone has also informed the dwarf green Brynhild that you are here and she is now on her way to you. Probably one of those blabbermouth developers for suspense and stuff. Forward, creatures! Make ready! Build traps and rooms and bring me more sharpened spears for my meeting with those damn developers later. Alrighty, so... We need to protect the stones from damage. Only real way to do that is by bleeding the enemy elsewhere, so... Uh, we are gonna try and do that by building in this direction. We're also gonna turn on this the stone, stone of speed to begin with. Of the creatures up. If you need the achievement still, don't that do not take that first. So all we're gonna do is lead the enemy around our stones here. That's all we're gonna do. And we want to lead them as far away as we can. And we're going to actually pump the snots as far as we can right away. Uh, because we need the quarry stone thing. Pretty clearly. Like, there's there's some gold here, which we would like to have. Uh, but we can't quite get, because we need to work around this. So, you know, it's a bit of a problem for us. More gold we can't get like that. Now, this mission has several problems for us in store. And some of which are dwarves. There's a lot of dwarves in this one. Which will be digging toward us. 
And that, of course, as you can imagine, is quite bad for us. We don't like that. And there's golden portals. I mean, there's basically everything you can imagine dealing with. You'll have to deal with it here. So, this way we can combine some portals into one, anyway. And... Yeah, it's, it's gonna be rough, trust me. Uh, let's get the snot upgrade so we can do the stones. So that way we can dig a little bit further out here. Like so, and we can take care of all this. So we can still work on the gold here. Easy peasy. That's nice. I think we can go deeper here as well. So let us do just that. Manivores have been discovered in your dungeon. Brimstone and gold. Just dig around all this. Give it a wide berth. Perfectly fine. Now we can't really go around here yet. Payday. So uh, we'll build. We'll build through here. Not like that. Build through here, like that. And fill this in. So enemies can't go through there. That protects two stones already. So this one here, we could protect with a little bit of a trap route for sure. Let's go kill the mana war. And let's see, what can we research? Nothing. <laughs> well, we could do more traps. Or some traps at all to begin with. So what creatures do we want? Definitely need one more of those. Maybe another imp. Okay, let's go upstairs, fight something, get some levels. Very good. Half our army is stuck. As is tradition. No, don't go closer. One of your creatures has died. Yeah, I'm not gonna care about the horde. They die, they die. This is exactly how it's gonna go. We're not gonna do any horde. We gotta concentrate on stuff. So these are them enemies. A new area has been and we're just gonna attack from here. So the enemy is gonna turn around and fight on our traps. It's not ideal, mind. As we get obliterated by all this stuff. An artifact was discovered in the dungeon. Oh boy. Actually, we might want to get some more horde creatures. Could help us generate more ghosts. Artifact. What is this? Demon spells cost 10% less mama. Mama. Artifact had been stored okay. and was now manifesting its powers. It's not great, not terrible either. Okay, so this is closed up somewhat. Let's go with some traps here. Hoy, come lads. Let's see some action down there in the Okay. <sighs> Smash that little dungeon crystal thingy or that guy's just off. standing around. Good or stuff. At least destroy a few rooms. So right now we don't have this thing here. So if he dies, he dies basically. So we don't get them back actually. So it's not super ideal. Uh, let's get the succubi or two. Upgrade our demons as well. 
Can't afford them, of course, because they're very, very costly. Let's upgrade this room. And... Look around, panicked. To motivate these guys to do their stuff. Oh! Oh no, that's not a Man of War. I thought for a second that was a Man of War. So there's a enemy attack group traveling through our lands. Perfectly fine. Nothing to worry about. We have a archer. Have appeared in your dungeon. I'm gonna ignore that bit over there and go for all the assassins. Like that. Okay, apparently we're not going for all the assassins. Well, we went for enough assassins. So we're gonna have enemies in the dungeon in a moment. I see the mana boars. Let's try and see if we can't kill these. Your enemies are in the dungeon. Okay, this guy's doing nothing. Well done. Good job, lad. So the enemy is just walking through because we haven't closed this up yet. So we'll have to fight this elite guard. And let's see if we can manage to force this down before the enemy does something actually detrimental. Oh, we have to teleport down immediately. Can't let this thing get damaged. The snots are working hard to get through here. We'll just put that there right now. Upgrade this room in size. Oh god, why do I every single time? I don't think I've ever done this first try proper. Not even once. Okay, can't upgrade what we need to upgrade. Let's buy us some doors. Let's at least do that. Let's get our dungeon heart doored. At least we can do that. All the stones get a door. It's the very least we can do to try and secure this a little bit. You got a door. You got a door. Alright. You don't. You get a door. So ideally... We could bring these around to the other side. Let's just try. Okay, there's some gold, that's not great. It's too close to the pathway. That we are going to go for. So there's some dwarves down here. I'm gonna make a bleeding me tankard out of that damn dark elf skull. And we Whereby actually can't go around there. Okay. Probably only enough for a shot glass. <laughs> Let's stop all this. Can't actually go that way. So we're gonna have to connect the other way around. Let's try that. Some more gold here. Well, that's in a decent enough position for now. Can we get around this place? Yes, but do give it a wide berth because the flamethrower of the dwarves goes through walls. And you're gonna hate yourself just as much as I hated myself when that killed my achievement last time. A portions for orphan shipment rode through the countryside. Destroying it would certainly yield a fair amount of evilness. Digging through here is not very fun. Now this is a diamond vein. 
but we'll just have to deal with not having that for now. What we need to do is dig around here, basically. As close as we can. Nope. No one does that. So this is as close as we get, basically. Can't dig through here, so we have to do this. We can use this. I hope the snot who digs that doesn't die. That would be very unfortunate for us. And them. More so them than us. Oi! Time to smash a few room sockets. Off you go. Take care of it, lads. Okay. Can we afford more creatures? Yes. Let's get a bunch of succubi. And then we go up. And for some reason that didn't pick everyone up. Now we have everyone. See if we can't try and intercept this. I don't think we can, especially since the enemy is coming right there. So maybe we no, we can't fight them first. Okay, cool. We're stuck now. Like we can't go for the caravan because these are in the way. And now we triggered them, so we can't even fight the other ones because everyone is going to come here now. Okay, they turn around, so we could try and fight them upstairs. Carriage filled with heroes on home leave sped across the map. Intercepting this would definitely yield some evilness. This is what we need to upgrade. We Ding need to just increase our undead yeah. research, basically. That's how we're gonna win this one. Or have a shot at it anyway. What is this? A single hero with one life. Uh. Okay, let's build a trap here. That should take care of that single hero with one life. Okay. Oh, we have enough evilness to go on the undead. Should have gotten more stuff than I just got, but... That's that. Oh god, more turrets. Can't fight through those yet. <sighs> okay. Let me go around that way. Okay, one caravan is going like that. Let's see. Uh, we definitely want the prison and this thing, but we can't afford it, so <laughs> we don't get the prison and that thing, so we just get the prison. Let's increase the size of this and put the prison next to it. Oh, great. Oh, great. It's just a shipment. Your creatures has died. I think that was the orc. Oh god, come on, just one hit. Now we run. We run. We run. We Your run. Nearly exhausted. Okay, now we have a lot of evilness lying about up here that we can't get. Good stuff. But we are discovering some crystals, so that's good for us. So let's build the prison. Let's upgrade the graveyard. Speaking of upgrading the graveyard, let's... 
Can't upgrade these. Can't buy these. Can't upgrade it. Oh, so the prison is going to be good for us because it gives us evilness, basically. Now let's dig this out for the dense floor. Let's throw in some doors in case the enemy makes it through. Let's get this place, this thing here. There's a diamond vein, as I said. Okay, now we need to fill this in, basically. Destroy this. Okay, new enemies are coming. Let's make this into a temple. Oh, great. I messed up. It's not big enough. So we'll dig it out a little bit around here. That should then be enough for the temple. We can honestly sell this. Put something else in there. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Oi, lads! It's time to kick some of those rune sockets to bits. And don't let that creature trash stop you. Okay. okay, this guy's dead. Never to return. of your creatures has bit the dust. So now we're going to generate some evilness from our prisoners. And I want to put in actually this. Get the evilness. An alternative artist obnoxiously colored there the dwarves come. rolled along a nearby road. The ultimate okay. evil would soon repaint his works in blood red. And there's more. <laughs> See what I mean? And this is easy. Uh, this, is, this is normal difficulty. This isn't even hard yet. I swear, this is... Are in the dungeon. Well, it's too much for me. It might be perfectly fine for you. For me, this is too much to deal with. It's just too difficult. Ah. Okay, this is never connected up, so this won't happen. Good stuff. Could get a demon bath. But I think we need this. Oh, we need both equally, kinda. Necromancer would be nice. In your Warrior, your days are numbered. The goddess of light will punish you. I already blew out the goddess's light in the last add on. Okay, so in a moment we can close this up. So enemies from this end won't just walk all over us anymore. Very good. So let's use one of those money crystals here. And honestly increase how much there can be in there. Let's unlock this. 
and give our undead a little dance all, shall we? You have unearthed a new area in the dungeon. Okay, there's the dwarves now. Let's go fight them. And see the flamethrowers? They go through walls. They could easily damage this if it's too close. You gotta be aware. You gotta be careful. One of your creatures has bit the dust. Yeah. Not sure what. Let's get a few more imps here. And a few more of these as well. And now we need to fight through here. Because the dwarves will provide some evilness, so that's nice. Gotta put our more vulnerable creatures behind so they don't get flamethrower to death. Ah, they'll figure it out. I hope. Your little snots have completely mined out a gold vein. So the gold vein mining isn't so bad right now. Because we just rescued this room here. So we can just mine this one out. Now we just need to take this down. There's another one over here though. are collecting their pay. Nice little bit of evilness infusion here for us. Alright, let's get them this. Like we have enough mana lying around to just build them a bath. So I wanted this to be the dance hall, but it this can be the bath just Enemies as well, and this can be the dance hall. Okay, now where are they going? Places. All right, let's let's go fight them. And immediately we see Okay, so him coming in here means we'll get a golden portal somewhere. They seem to have actually received a blessing which would at least explain the strange shimmering. Jokes or not, we're gonna wipe the floor with that handful of heroes. Forward, creatures! Hack those weapons! Sharpen those traps and polish your opponents! <laughs> Alright, I don't see a golden portal though, so maybe I'm wrong. Okay, so this is closed off. There's some evilness for us to take. That. Oh. I thought 250 meant we have enough for something, but clearly we do not. Let's pick up some of that mana and throw it in the mana bath. And we cannot. We have enough lying around here. To fill this up a little bit. Okay. 
So these enemies Your shouldn't enemies be going through attention. anymore. We can sell these traps because nothing is running through them anymore. Just pick all this up, throw it in here. They're gonna go all the way around. So we want everyone here kind of all the way around. So we'll build a little trap route down Enemies here, I think. The dungeon. It's not gonna be the prettiest we've built, but it's gonna do the trick. I hope. It's just very constant, the onslaught, so... Oh, no. Let's get them out here. So the southern enemies aren't a problem for us. The northern enemies are only a slight problem for us. Like, we could already fight them right here. Need to make sure that this one here stays at the back. At the back, not out of the battle. We're supposed to fight. And now we pick up all them heroes, kick them into the prison, pick up the evilness. Just so the snots don't run around wildly. And we're gonna get this here, expert spell. Uh, because that gives us the Dungeon Lord, which will be essential for expanding upstairs, I think. I don't think we can really do it without. We definitely need to unlock this here, but faction research is too low for it. So not much we can do about that just now. Could upgrade this. Still not quite sure what efficiency on the gold room, on, on the... Yeah, on the gold room means, but it's okay. Let's build out all this a little bit. Since we're supposed to build like 50 traps, you know, might as well have a real big workshop. Payday. So these are near dead. That's good. Could go upstairs, honestly. But I'd rather have this done. Let's motivate these guys a bit. Some prison capacity wouldn't hurt us either. Manivores have been discovered in your dungeon. So now I can close up this here. Basically, like once this is done, they have to go Mary through Antoinette's here. Antoinette's cake for the poor express was whizzing by near the dungeon. Would the diabetic evil let it just do that? And it's not really close to the dungeon, but it's close enough. Let's kill these guys. And then we can go up. Oh, come on. See each other, please. I mean, they're probably gonna die here. Oh. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Okay, let's fight from this end then. And get this fool out, so she stays back and fights. Let's give the succubi and the imps a bit more range. The imps more range, honestly. 
and buy a few more imps. Okay, gotta deal with the mana war here. All this goes into the mana bath. Okay. And now we can try and intercept that shipment there. I mean, we did clear this out. So if we can catch it there, maybe. And we got the speed buff, so... Might just work out in the end. And if it's just the transporter... Oh, it isn't. But there's no towers here, so... Construction crew set out to rebuild the destroyed hero buildings. Okay, we lost our hero here. Let's upgrade the re evilness vault. Upgrade this. Ah, by this. Perfect. Upgrade them. One of your creatures has died. Okay, we're gonna go back. And intercept that work crew out here. Okay, we need to get rid of these people following us. Because they came out of the portal. They came out of the city. They're gonna go back, yep. Can you please just get together? So we can intercept this work crew. Which has a very long way to go still. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Ah, great. But at least they're coming from this end. So that's not too bad. Let's upgrade this so we can have more prisoners in there. And now we build the big uh, hero undead vault, basically. Which might be a bit of a difficulty to get because there's all this gold in the way which we need to excavate first. That's okay. We'll just build it like this. For the time being. Come on everyone, quicker. Can't get the Vampire Queen yet. Should have thought of that before. But with transformed heroes, you know, we might not have that much of a problem anymore. Payday. can intercept them here as well. And we should get on building some traps and stuff, so uh, let's go. Let's go upgrade this room. <laughs> Make it real big. Give it some doors. Okay, looks good. Okay, stop everyone. Now we go back down. That looks pretty darn good. We have no gold, that's our problem right now. Let's build the treasure chamber here. Oh. 
Okay, we just ran into the enemy. I'm not sure if that's good or bad. Looks like we're winning, so we'll just say it's good. And it was very much intentional. Totally on purpose. We still can't close this. Why? You can go here and then you get through there. Why can't we close that up? What are we blocking? I don't see anything we would be blocking. I don't know why this isn't closing. No idea why we're not allowed to block that. Now we can build this. There are enemies in your dungeon. Forward, my faithful. Destroy the moon sockets. The goddess sends you a blessing. Okay, so now we close this up. So they're not gonna come through that. So now everyone goes through the trap maze, which isn't a trap maze yet, but at least we got everyone going the right in the same direction. That's nice. So this stuff is being built. We're still doing fine on gobblers. Okay, let's go fight these. A construction crew was on its way to repair and rebuild the destroyed hero structures. Being bunched up like that might not be good because our ranged he creatures might get real close and But it's fine, we got enough succubi to deal with it. Now we deal with these by plopping down there. And we'll pick up this lady. She will be our first enemy in this. Okay, who's dying? All of our imps. Good stuff. Well, not all of them, but enough that I make such sweeping statements, basically. Boy, what the hell kind of ape show is this, damn it? <laughs> Looks like it's time I took matters into my own hands and give this filth a good thrashing. If we open Even this up, the this not should have uh, a shorter way words, to bring in even this. So Brunhild herself is not coming. That's not great for us. Okay. Um, let's upgrade to get the Vampire Queen. And upgrade our Succubi. Because we have the most of those, honestly. Succubi and Imps. Can I do it correctly this time? Yes, I managed. Good on me. I'm not sure why I'm digging that out, but I am. Didn't even work. Okay. Let's take care of these uh, intruders here. Put down there. Let's start building some stuff here. Okay, 
there's another priestess. And we could use a tank, maybe. Elite warden. Sure. Let's open this up further. Maybe just go with the brimstone. The dungeon. Hmm, this might even actually seem to be a little exciting. Oh, what's that stink down here? Time to wear this place out and take out the trash. Oh, well, don't worry, I'll just cut off your nose so you don't have to smell anything. And of course, by that, I mean that my creatures will take care of it. Go ahead, grab her, smack her on the schnoz, and rub fiery chili powder on her mucus membranes. <laughs> Okay, we completely destroyed everything we built in here. Brimstone is fairly violent, after all. So that wasn't smart. But whoever said we were... I don't think no one would believe us if we did. So Brunhild is coming here. Let's go attack from behind, so we don't actually get into battle Enemies with everyone, you know? Okay, and now we're gonna go fight these guys because um, we just had a little bit too close a scrape and scrap there for my liking. What's dying on the front line? Well, that answers that question. Also, we have a lot of death here. I don't like that. Let's put these on the back line, really. Oh, we're losing a lot of creatures here. We're losing everything. Like, we literally lost every single creature just there. What the hell? They didn't even have healers? Okay. I don't understand. Okay, so this is going to be a problem for sure. It's payday. Because everyone is stuck resurrecting Talia again. I hate that so much. I don't know why they did that. Why does everyone go there? Like, just your complete economy just stops if Talia dies. I get it. It shouldn't happen. But why? It's not even very quick, honestly. It's just... Very annoying. So how is our army? non-existent okay Talia's back anyway let's try this okay if they if they're fighting this not then they're not attacking us elsewhere so can we win this now please is this possible I tell you this on hard no fun whatsoever. It really just isn't fun. That's that's all it is. It just is not fun. We 
might not be able to win this. We are not winning this. I can't do Stalia again because they're just gonna attack. Snots are just gonna do nothing again. Yeah, we're, we're pretty dead, I think. We're pretty darn dead. We don't have enough evilness to call in the ultimate evil. Okay. Let's attack from behind here. So we can get the wizards out. Okay, one before. wizard is dead. And use them as pedestals for my weapon stand. <laughs> and we don't have to sit in the in the area attack, honestly. We don't have to. No one can force us to. Opened in front of Brynhild, the Dwarf Queen, and transported her to safety. What? No way! Treachery! I was just getting ready to give that dwarf the nose job I promised her earlier. Oh, you'll pay for this, Thanos. Not this time, Thanos. Instead, a few of my faithful are going to visit your dungeon. Prepare yourself for the wrath of the light! With an unpleasant plop, a couple of freshly rested heroes suddenly appeared in the dungeon. Ah, uh, I hate stupid game mechanics like this. That's cheating. I'm gonna wipe the floor with them. Okay. Okay, creatures, we're not gonna wipe the floor with them. Flatten them. Cut off their support socks. <laughs> Yeah, this is stressful, but at least we're fighting these off actually like we are properly winning against these Oh great we had a lot of creatures just killing our um, Our graveyard Enemies so every undead creature dying will be dead now That's fantastic. Thank you. You have lost a creature forever Yeah, that's that'd be an undead Let's get a Vampire Queen in here, so we get some healing on our undead. Maybe get a Necromancer too. Definitely get this. This and that. Okay, I think, I think we managed finally. Okay, great. So these are all reserved already. Can't even put our own uh, selection of enemies in here. Oh well. Now we need to survive payday and we don't have any gold crystals left. The swimming Woo. with dolphins for the starving relief society was moving a donation to a safe place. Unfortunately, they had not counted on the merciless evils nearby dungeon.
All of these are getting built and they're immediately occupied by something that we already have because of our creatures keep, keep being dying. Oh my lord. At least we're not lacking for evilness for once. That's usually a something I deal with. Or rather I have to deal with. Okay, let's get all of our imps immediately out of here. And throw them on the back end. Okay, we have a pyro. Looking better now. We have two priestesses at least. And we have space for another creature. And I think I want to have the big mage here. The archmage. The elite priestess can languish here. Okay, we cleaned up a little bit. Let's go upstairs now. Take our little horde for a spin. Like, can we catch this? Yes. At least something. We should be seeing enemies again in a moment, so... A new area of the dungeon has been discovered. Oh god. Talia! No! Oh, Talia. Okay, let's fall back here. We're getting ripped. The getting ripped apart. Once again let Talia die. Yeah, I didn't I didn't see the dwarves on time. Speaking of dwarves, we are dead. We are, they're going to go for this, aren't they? Oh, they're not. Well, that's good. That's very good for us. So now I just somehow need to... Kill the enemy here. With the healing from the priest Tessus, it actually kind of works. Okay. Two portals. And we're not killing anything anymore. Nothing is dying. And they don't have healers. Keep in mind, they don't have healers. This is just dwarves with a tank. That's all. That's all that is. And I think they're killing my healers. Yep, yep, yep. My god, I'm so done with this. I have enough evilness, just Talia isn't level One of six. Your creatures has died. Where is Talia? Okay, she's fighting. And let's get her to level six. If we can. But I don't think we can. There are enemies in your dungeon. Look at this. Ah. 
<laughs> this is all I have. It's the healer and a million snots running around. Everything else is dead. But the million snots are actually saving us. <laughs> the enemies are preoccupied with them. Talia just needs to reach level 6, then we're done. So I need to keep an eye on her. Okay, let's clean up. Dwarves are building new rooms underground. Yeah, good stuff. Come on, clean up, my boy. Okay. Let him deal with the dwarves. He'll deal with them. A group of careless heroes march listlessly through the countryside. I can't pick him up. Would yield a He's just stuck doing that. God, no. Gimme him. Gimme him. He needs to kill these. Okay. Now he needs to kill that heart. And we need to deal with this while everyone else is kind of preoccupied here. Let's see. No, I picked him up on him. No, I didn't want to pick him up. Oh, no. But F2 picks everyone up. Okay, let's do it. Come on. Come on. Yes, very good. Kill everything. Okay, okay, okay. No, we're not finishing this portal before everyone comes in. And there's another portal here, of course. Okay. And where will they go? To the portal or back? To the heart, I mean. Okay, they go to the heart. Then we have to fight here, no problem. Let's upgrade our traps a little. Let's maybe get some necromancers in. Let's... Upgrade a bunch. <laughs> oh God. This is so bad. A gold vein has been mined out. Okay, I think we... No, we didn't kill everyone. Is that a new group? Let's kill the portal first. Okay, now we can deal with this. The snots are saving us, I swear. I don't even care if I lose anything anymore. Just part of the business now. Alright, so we've taken care of the wolves. There's another golden portal. Let's deal with that. And let's finally close this thing up here.
Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. You can do it! Oh. Okay, fine, you can't do it. I had too much hope in my snots. It's the last gold vein, isn't it? Not quite. There are more here. Okay, let's take out this portal. And give the regeneration to anyone. Talia, for example. I think I didn't hit Talia. I don't even know if you can give this to Talia. Okay, they have to walk the long way now. We are finally somewhat safe down here. Talia and the planning evil had completed the ritual. Finally! Fine! Oh, alright, okay. Man, that crap took forever. That's crazy. That stupid ritual. Well, first off, the ritual site still needs to be cleaned, but we'll get on to that in part three of this mission. Part three? Are you freaking serious? <laughs> Just kidding. The ritual is over. Wow. You're really dancing on a volcano. You know that? My sense of humor has now left the building. Okay. But what has this ritual brought us? <sighs> the witty evil's plan had come to full fruition. A huge, powerful field of energy arose between the room sockets. A powerful weapon, capable of destroying even a being charged by the stones of finitude, such as the mutated Thanos. Oh, I get it now. So, we've set up a giant energy trap for Thanos, and now all we have to do is shove him into it. Huh, not a bad plan at all. Better than what I would have expected from those kitsch scribblers. Okay then, off to the final battle! That spear for Thanos' head is still frightfully lonely. Alright, okay, so this was exhausting. I must say, this was exhausting as a mission. Um, I'm glad I didn't try this on hard another time because I think I would have just lost my mind. Um, so yeah, th th this is kind of how you do it. If you finish it on hard or if you did finish it on hard, congratulations. Let us know down in the comments how you did it. If you haven't checked out the Twitch, go do that eventually. Maybe give us a follow there. And uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy even though I found this to be really exhausting and not quite as fun as it could have been. Um, but yeah, that's the Rune Sockets Affinitude Part 2. See you in the next one. Until then, bye-bye.